A northern Kentucky school district is grieving tonight after the sudden death of an eighth grade girl. 13 year old Liliana Chalk was in Columbus for a cheerleading competition when she died on Saturday. Josh Bazan spoke to school leaders who are trying to bring the community together in the face of tragedy. The principal here at Highlands Middle School says Liliana was a leader and a positive role model, someone the entire community is going to miss. I think we're all processing it. Uh, I mean, even adults struggle with, with how to feel and how to react to it, so it's a one day at a time approach. It's a loss everyone at Highlands Middle School is feeling. We started working right away. We knew you know, this community wants to be together for moments like this, uh, and they want to support each other. Principal Michael Houghton says Liliana Shock was the kind of student and person everyone looked up to. Now, her friends and classmates are trying to figure out what to do next after the eighth grader died suddenly on Saturday. It's all right to grieve. I think that's the message we want to send kids is that it, it's all right to have that moment of sadness and recognize that, that you, you miss your friend, you, you miss this person that was in our halls every day. The community gathered for a private vigil tonight to remember Liliana, and the school will have counselors available for students and staff this week. She was on the high school cheerleading team and also cheered with Premier Athletics. She was at a cheerleading event in Columbus with her club when she died. At that event this morning, cheerleaders and families held a moment of silence for Liliana. And it's going to take a while to to come to this realization that, that this has happened. Uh, you know, it, it, is, it is tragic and she will be missed and it will be hard to, to move past this, but together we'll certainly, uh, uh, we'll certainly be able to do it much better than, than apart. Right now, school officials aren't saying what exactly caused the eighth grader to die, only that she suffered a medical emergency. Reporting at Highlands Middle School, Josh Bazan, nine on your side.